The light rail transit project was launched as a joint venture of the Urban Development Authority and the Megapolis and Western Province Development Ministry as a foreign investment initiative with the objective of easing traffic congestion in Colombo and thereby replicating an idea that has been successfully implemented in developed countries. Once implemented, you would enjoy a hassle-free commute replete with electronic payment systems a comfortable journey and even supermarket facilities at every station. It is no secret that traffic congestion in Colombo has reached unprecedented and insufferable levels, especially since the 15% space for expansion of the road network has been exhausted. The light rail transit, therefore, was the one available solution to this vexing problem. The light rail transit, then, is a public transportation facility that takes you quickly to your destination. For example, the light trains depart from stations every five minutes, ensuring an absolute minimum commuting time for office workers as well as everyone else. Moreover, the entire system will ensure accessibility to the differently abled. In short, it will save everyone a lot of time yield enormous economic benefits. It must be noted that for decades, in addition to public transport, an enormous number of private vehicles enter the city of Colombo on a daily basis. The fuel cost alone is monumental, and so too the pollution. The light rail transit, which offers comfortable travel, will operate along three lines, red, blue and green. Accordingly, the first route starts from the Ragama railway station and will pass the outer circular road and reach the Fort railway station through Kadavata, Kiribakkoda, Paliagoda, Panchikavata and Maradana and thereafter proceed to Kerlapana passing the Regal Cinema, Slave Island, Navaloka Hospital, Navamavata, Duplication Road, Bambalapitiya and Tummulla Junction. The second will begin in Moradua and will proceed to Piliandala passing Katubadda and Moradua campuses. It will thereafter take the 120 bus route, turn into the old Kasbava road to reach Delkanda Junction and from there it will proceed along Baseline Road after passing Nugegoda and Kerlapana. This route will pass Demotogoda on its way to the Kalanir railway station, taking a track that is parallel with the railway line. The third route begins at the Kottava interchange. It moves along the high-level road to Pannibitya and then along the 174 bus route, passing the Three Bridges Junction and take the Denzil Kobagadua Mavata to end at the Hunubitya railway station, having passed Koswatta, Battarmulla, Angoda, Mulleriava, Kalaniya Temple and the Tire Corporation Junction. All three routes will be connected to the main railway stations from which there will be luxury bus services operating in coordination with the relevant timetables. Very soon, you will be able to conduct your business in a truly beautiful city of Colombo that is free of traffic congestion. The light railway transit running along three tracks marked in red, blue and green. A relaxed, 
hassle-free journey. A project of the Megapolis and Western Province Development Ministry.